An investigation continues this afternoon after a wrong way driver and a deadly crash slowed the morning commute on southbound I-75 here in Detroit. Let's head on out to our Coco McAvoy who is joining us live there at the scene of that crash. Coco, do police have any idea what caused this driver to go the wrong way? Good afternoon, Everett. It's still too early to tell what caused the driver to go the wrong way on the freeway this morning. You can see traffic is moving along just fine now here this afternoon, but this morning there was a major backup because the freeway was closed for hours. An early morning crash shut down I-75 near Mack Avenue in Detroit for hours. Michigan State Police and firefighters responded to the crash site. Car parts and debris were strewn on the freeway. Police say a woman was driving the wrong way on 75 at 4 o'clock this morning, causing a crash that killed her. The woman was driving her Saturn northbound on the southbound side of 75 when she collided head on with another driver in a Chrysler Pacifica. The woman in the Pacifica was trapped for over a half an hour. Detroit firefighters had to use the jaws of life to cut her out of the vehicle. And once they did, she was rushed to the hospital. Her condition is unknown at this time. The freeway opened several hours later. Police are still investigating to figure out how this wrong way crash happened. And police have not yet released the names of either driver involved in this crash. But of course, we will be getting an update from them this afternoon. So we'll, of course, update you as soon as we learn more information. Reporting live this afternoon, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4. All righty, Coco, we certainly are thinking about the other driver. Hope they make a full recovery.